I've been weaving along and I want to take this piece, this finished piece here off the loom um, because say if you're doing some sampling or something you're not quite sure if this yarn's going to work out after it's been through the wash or whatever it is. You want to take this part off but you've still got a bit of warp left on the yarn. Uh, you've still got a bit of yarn left on the warp rather um, and you want to keep using it. You can cut it off and retie it. You don't have to discard this and do an entire new warp. So to do that we just need to release the tension at the front. Okay. Make sure your heddle is in neutral position so it's not going anywhere. And just simply cut this piece off the loom. And as long as all of these threads are still coming through the heddle, you're fine. You don't have to re-thread. Okay, so we've got this piece here that's to come off. So I just release the break and I can pull that piece off. I can undo all of these knots and take that piece off. You probably don't need to see me undo all these knots, so I'll come back when they're all undone. Okay, so I've finished undoing the knots on my last piece, and I've put that aside. Uh, I need to put the front brake back on with the apron rod, apron rod sticking out towards the heddle, um, as far as it'll go, and then put your brake on once you've got it lined up like that. Then we can release the tension on the back. Grab your threads and just gently pull until you have enough thread hanging over to tie it onto the apron rod. Now, my warp's nearly done here, but if yours isn't, don't keep pulling it because you've released the tension on the back brake and it will keep coming. Mine's stopping because my, I'm nearly at the end of mine. Um, so just be aware of that. that as you're pulling it, just pull it gently, just to the right amount, and then put your brake back on. And then you see we've got, we're still all threaded up, don't have to do all of that again. And now you just go through your regular tying on process. Um, just as you normally would at, for this step of your weaving and um, just carry on with that and yeah you're fine you can keep weaving